hello hello queens it is your girl kanisha and i am back with another video about my mid-year planners that i will be using this is part two if you are interested in seeing what else i have added to my collection please stay tuned guys so in my last video I showed you guys um, what I was going to be using for my mid-year and I also talked about an adding another planner in which I went ahead and got another one and this planner is um something different for me I was using a planner that I was going to try to do the um the Franken planning in I think that's what it's called where you add in extra pages and I was trying to make it out to the rest of the year, but I decided I wasn't going to use it. So I went ahead and purchased me another one because they were on sale at Michael's for 50% off. And I did find an 18 month, but this one is different. This is a horizontal. I've always loved horizontal planners, but I could never get into decorating them. I know I never knew how to decorate them, but I am going to try something different. Um... And hopefully it works. If not, I also purchased um, an undated dashboard layout. And I'm not sure when these planners actually came out, but I'm going to go ahead and do a flip through. And I also have one that I purchased for my work. Um, and I found this one as well. I found this one at Hobby Lobby. I've never had a happy planner for my work because um i always went with agenda 52 but they, they was kind of on a cheaper side but i just wanted to go ahead and go ahead and try the happy planner because i did find it it is an hourly layout which works better for me and my uh when i'm scheduling my meetings so let's go through this one i hope everybody is doing well Okay, so this one is um, Universe. It is an 18 month horizontal layout. And I'm gonna go ahead and take these off. All right, and I kind of fell in love with this because of the colors of the the colors of the dashboards in here i like i said i've never did a horizontal and playing with me but i plan on using this one i'm stuttering i plan on using this one for my creative journal because i'm going to get back into journaling i um created i created this to do my journaling in and um i kind of changed my mind i'm still kind of on the fence because i want to use my happy planner horizontal layout but this is just a journal that i created and being that i wanted to use my stickers to kind of create it i don't know i think this will this will hold me more accountable and make me write in it every day i think it will because the dates are already there and i know i'm not gonna want to open it after i um finish it i'm not gonna be like, oh, I, I did miss a day. I mean, it's okay to miss a day. Nobody's perfect. It's okay. But I think this will make me be more accountable and journal every day because I do need to get back in the habit of that. And that's why I started creating journals on my own because I have always loved journaling. I've always did that. Even when I was in school, high school, I've always journaled down my thoughts or whatever. So I did go, go on and create journals for other people and People buy them, and this is just a bag. She's just a, a image that I created, but I think she's really cute, and I still may use it um, for journaling. But right now, I'm gonna try my happy planner. And if this don't work, I think I'll just I don't know. I'm kind of still on the fence, but I'm thinking I'm gonna try it. My creative journaling in here, and this is the inside color, cover. It's a like a tie dye. And I'm going to take this off 
I'm just gonna cut this. But like I said, this is the only reason why I purchased this because I love the colors of it. Um, this is my planner page, my happy planner page. This planner belongs to, and then you have your overly. Um, your yearly overview. Oh, and let me let y'all see these discs. They are some glitter, silver glitter in these discs. It looks like a silver glitter and it's so cute. It's a clear disc. Um, and then these packages here, I plan on using these a little bit more. Um, and then here's your currently page and then your first dashboard. It says take time to repair the soul. And I think this is why I kind of geared toward more towards using this as a creative journal because of the inside of it. I don't think I told y'all what was on the front of it. This says this is your year. And that's in silver. So let's do August. Oh, let me let you see the this is your monthly layout and then this is a hard the horizontal layout and it is very clean and i like that so we have um it's dots here polka dot here which i don't think that'll bother me um not one bit when i'm decorating so i know y'all have seen horizontal layouts <laughs> um, but um here's the august and this says alignment and you are in the right place at the right time. Move forward in harmony and faith as you build towards your soul's desire. And this further lets me know that I need to use this as my creative journal. September says put your whole heart into it. It's cute. It's like a, a beige color with your colorful heart. I don't know why I'm stuttering today. And this one says protection. This is really cute. It looks like um maybe cotton candy almost it's like a cotton candy color this is a blue and it fades into the pink and it says protection you are being guided and supported through whatever you are focused on at the moment keep going that's cute i like that oh look at november it says relax everything is running right on schedule oh the universe i need that and it has a little um this is a heart Kind of faded into the pink. I love that. I love that. This is so cute. Only if Happy Planner did double-sided dashboards, y'all. This that would be so dope. So dope. And this one is like a blue and green color. It says luck. And it says luck and good fortune are coming your way. Keep doing what you're doing. Y'all, I love it. I'm so excited now. I'm so ready to start journaling in here. I'm so ready. Yes, this is going to be my uh, my creative journal. That's what I'm going to use this for. Hands down. Um, and this one is like another cotton candy color. Oh, my favorite. Butterflies. It got butterflies on here. Oh, it says you are on the right path. It was made for you. Oh, I love it. I can't wait. I'm just getting excited off these dashboards, y'all. <laughs> oh, y'all look at this this is so cute purple is my favorite color y'all this is so cute oh this is so cute it says the self love club it's so cute and now I am so eager to what I'm going to be writing in here I'm so ready and excited March is pink and white and it says, leave more space to breathe in life. I'm loving this. I'm loving it. Okay. April says, surround yourself with positive positive energy. Your mental well-being, your success, and your happiness depend on it. <laughs> if this is not speaking to my soul, come on. Come on, happy planner. And this one is uh, pink and it fades into purple in the center. And it says, it's okay to go slow. It is definitely okay to go slow. And this is green uh, for June. It says, whatever is good for you, whatever is good for your soul, do that. Y'all, do what make you happy. Do what make you happy. 
<laughs> and then the next one is growth. Ooh. And look at the butterfly. It's so cute. And it says, life isn't just about creating yourself. It's for discovering who you are truly meant to be. Mm. Mm, I love it. I love it. I love it. And the next one, it says, I'm a work in progress. That's cute. That's cute. And I love this. And for you. Oh, look at that. Wiped off on my finger. I think I had another planner like that. That did that. Had extra excess. Look at the foil flying around. Okay. That's August. And then we're going to do September of 2025. It says, seek to be whole, not perfect. Oh, I know a lot of us need that. I like it. And this almost, it looked like it's a grayish color with the green on there. I like it. Okay, so the next one is October. It says, I am worthy. I'm deserving. There is abundance. What is for me is for me. I heard that, Happy Planner. Come on, y'all coming on through with this one. Oh, I kind of need to go buy another one and save it. I love this one. Um, and this is November. It says, we are never finished becoming who we truly are. Come on now. Come on now. Ooh -wee. And the last one is December. I got my butterfly again. It says, my healing must come first so that everything I love in life doesn't come last. Come on, speak to myself. Y'all, I love this. I so love it. And then the back cover looks like the candy, the cotton candy um, flavor. <laughs> That's what it looked like to me. Cotton candy. And it just says, plan a happy life. You got that there. And then here is the back. And it it's like a burst out for the universe. Y'all, I love this. I love this. I can't wait to start journaling. I cannot wait. I love it. I love it. I'm going to put this to the side over here. No, I think. I'm just going to take it off completely. Because I'm going to do my. Um, do the flip through for my one for work. Although. Um, Y'all won't be seeing much of this. Because it is. Like I said for work. And it's. I'll be using to schedule meetings, but I do want to go through and do a flip through of this one. And this one is called the Dreamscape. It is a vertical hourly layout and it is 18 months. And we have our baby blue or sky blue. I want to say it's a baby blue disc. And I really love it. That's, those discs are so cute to me. So we're going to take this off so we can go ahead and put this baby put it to work all right this will be my first time using a big my first time using a big let me move this off my desk i don't know why i'm keeping it up there all right first let's look at the cover and adore it it's so cute i'm loving these colors y'all this blue and the pink with the clouds here then it got silver stars here i'm loving this i'm loving this i guess everything is with the universe with me to today or this year for the rest of this year and next year because my last one was that color and this says you light up the sky i'm loving this already and then here is um the inside cover is almost like a a water a watercolor here. That's grayish colored and it has the stars in here. So this almost kind of look like the universe. And oh look at this. This is cute. This looks like just the galaxy. <laughs> it reminds me of space. Out of space. Y'all look, it's so cute. I am loving this. Oh, they did their thing with this. I love this. Now it makes me want to decorate it. And I'm going to put my name there. And this is your yearly overview, 2024-2025. Oh, and I may use these for something. I don't know. Um, 
because we do a lot of events at work. We do I do a lot of outreach. Um, I may use this for that and keep up with everybody's birthday uh, that I work with here. Okay, and then here's my currently page, and this is the normal page that I'm used to seeing. And this says, for July, be bravely you. That's cute. It looks like um, like under the sea or something. Look like some flowers under the sea. And then here is my monthly layout. And here is the hourly layout, y'all. And this is what I'm loving. I love this. And this, this is going to work out perfect for me. Because I can even plan my my day, my entire day in here if I want to. Um, Like when I get up and go to the gym. I'm normally at the gym at 530. But I can put from the gym from, yeah, from 5, around 5 and 530. I'm walking in the gym. And I normally stay there to about 7. My 6.45 or 7, depends on what time I get there. And I come home and get my shower and get ready for work. And then I work. And then me, to schedule my meetings, I do them um, by the hour. This this is going to work out perfect. This is going to work out perfect. And I'll show y'all. I think I did a video last year on what I was using. Let me grab it real quick. Because I almost bring my planner home with me every day. Um, yeah, I bring it home with me almost every day. Make sure I have any appointments. Okay, so I'm just going to flip right here for December the 9th through the 15th. And this is how it is. And I was knowing, I was writing the time blocks out myself up here. Oh, I wish I could show y'all. Hold on, let me see if I can find it. Okay, so this is how I was using my planner. I was writing in the time blocks, and if they had a meeting like at 10 o'clock, I would write it up top. And if they had one at 11, I would write it up in here. So it's kind of like I made my own eight slots um, for this. And it was kind of like once I got back to to the point where I was, it was it was very time consuming trying to do that, and because I have to get them, I have to get the boxes. The boxes, the right size, the, everything had to be the same size for me, y'all, because it's like a bit of OCD-ish kicks in. You can see where I took a ruler and kind of drew my lines out, y'all. It, it was crazy. I was tired of doing that. So, um, this does go out to the end of December, and I'll probably still use it to the end of December. Um, just to, like, jot it down real quick and then put it back in here nice and neatly. Just to keep up with everything. But... Yeah, this is going to work out so much better for me. Um, Let's get back to this. Okay, for August, and this is my birthday month with August. It says bright days ahead. I'm loving that. That's, that's the same co um, dashboard as the cover. Yep, same as the cover. Then we're going to go into September. It says love and light. I'm loving it. And then um, October says look on the bright side. Oh, and then for November, it's so fancy. It says wishes and dreams. And this is so cute. It's like a pink and cream color. That's cute. I'm like, I'm loving it. Winter colors pink. Oh, look at December. What does it say? Okay, it says life is lovely and so are you. And that's in gold for you. That's cute. I don't know why I think I can feel the flowers like it should be raised up or something. It's so cute. And for January, it says shine bright. We're going to shine bright like a diamond. And then it says see the good in all things. And that is one thing that I am on. I've been on it all year long. No negativity around me whatsoever. I don't care who you are. You can go. <laughs> And then this is March. It says, say, say yes to new adventures. And this is in a silver foil. It's cute. And then April. And this is just like the galaxy. Um, a galaxy look to me. It's cute with the with gold accent stars. That's cute. That's really cute. 
And then for May, it says, oh, how lovely. Now, this would have been cute for December. This would have been cute for December or even January. I think that theme kind of go more with that, with that season. It's cute. And then it said, create some happy for June. July says, seek beautiful in all things. Not seek beautiful, y'all. That does not say seek beautiful. July says, seek beauty in all things. Cutesy. And this is like sketchy. The blues and the whites. A little hint of black. Or maybe that's navy blue instead of black. For September. Oh, that was for August. For September, it says reach for the sky. And it just has the moon up here. And then we go into October. This cute for fall colors. This is cute. It says dream big and shine bright. I'm loving that. And then for November, it says wild free and totally happy. All right. And then for December, it says not everything needs to be perfect to be wonderful. That's cute. I am overall happy with this planner. This is why they call it happy planner, huh? And then this is the same as the front cover. And then here is the back. I really like this. This is so cute. I can't wait to transfer my appointments uh, for the end of the year up in here. I can't wait. But this is for my work. Um, my work planner. And then I am going to show you all what else I have. Um, I can go through this one as well. This is an undated dashboard layout just in case somebody wants to go and get this one. And I bought this one just to kind of like add pages in that other vertical just in case I wanted to do a different layout. I can do that. And after I bought it, I was like, I, got, I have some undated verticals. But, yeah, we got it now. So, you can never have too many planners. And I can always use it another day. Okay. So, let's go back. It is with the gold disc. And I'm lo I love this cover. I, I love this cover. So, I just had to get it. I could not pass up on it at all. The inside cover is black with stars in it. Oh, the front, I'm so sorry, y'all. The front of it said, just says plans. That's all. Just says plans. And then you have your um, your monthly stickers, which are in gold foil. And then, happy planner. This planner belongs to. And then, of course, we're going to put my name in here to seal the deal. And I'm loving this. Look at the smileys. It's already making it fun. And then here's your currently layout or your monthly overview. I know a lot of um, um, these, I probably use it for my monthly overview up in my creative journal. Like maybe use it for my goals or something like that in that creative journaling. Um, and this is the first dashboard. This is so cute. I'm loving these colors with this. That's cute. Okay, and y'all know what a horizontal look like. I'm, oh, this is a dashboard. This is a dashboard. I thought this was a vertical. Okay, yep, that's right. That's right, because I was going to get this, and I was like, oh, I didn't want to get it because it was a, a dashboard, and I didn't know how to decorate a dashboard, but I did get my mini Happy Planner in the dashboard. So this will give me multiple options if I want to do... Um, I got so excited. If I want to do horizontal one week, if I want to do a dashboard one week, and I, I have those verticals that I can use as well, I can use that if I want to um, decorate that one week, which I think I'm going to try all of them just to see which one I like the best. Um, but I'm going to try to stick with that horizontal. I'm so glad I opened this because I totally forgot that this was a dashboard. And let me read the front of it because I did not do that. I'm skipping over stuff. It's Happy Bright's Dashboard Layout 12 Months Undated. Y'all, if I would have looked at that before, I wouldn't have been got so excited about it being a dashboard. But yeah, it's a dashboard layout. 
and we all i mean i don't know if somebody here new that don't know anything about happy planners but yeah this is a dashboard layout and i'm so excited i was gonna say everybody know what the dashboard layouts look like but it may be somebody here that's never seen a happy planner or never seen the inside of a dashboard um planner but this one says happy plans in the making i'm loving this all right and then the next tab it says find your happy and let's see what's the next one? Oh, the blue one. Oh i love these colors y'all i'm all about my colors i love these a perfect grid colorful gr colorful grid colorful grid <laughs> Okay, and this is a yay, yay, yay. All right, all right. You got your grid down here in pink, and then this is solid. I'm loving that. And then the next one. Oh, this is a cute checker. I love it. I love checkered things. Happy Planner just released an undated, um, it's a big checker, and I want it so bad. I think I'm going to get it, because since it's undated, I may just get it. I'm going to have to save up some more money for my plan on stock because, y'all, yeah, I've been spending. Everybody was having those summer um, summer sales, warehouse sales, and I've been on it. I've been on it, and I can't wait to share um, my planner haul that I have. And this one just says hello in all different colors on a beige background. That's cute. And then this one says, make today super. And live in the moment. Ooh, look at this. This is a holographic gold on black. Ooh, that's cute. That's cute. Okay, and this one is says, it's your journey and your heart knows the way. Yes, yes. And ooh, another checkered, pink and red checkers. I love it. Look at the little smiley face. I love it. Yeah, I am so in love with planners. I have like a whole obsession, addiction. Yeah, but I'd rather have that addiction than anything else. But I am trying to get back on my planner-ish. Okay, and then we did, I did go through my mini. I changed out the disc with some um, silver ones because I couldn't find any gold expander disc, any gold metal. I wanted the metal, but I did change these out. Um, and nothing has been, nothing extra has been added to this. Not yet. Um, yeah, everything is still the same in here. And it's just ready to, ready for me to get started with it. And I'm so ready. And I think I'm going to try to decorate. I'm going to try to decorate this. I don't know if I'm going to record it, being that it's going to be my first one that I'm decorating in the mini. But I'm going to try it. But I am loving this so far. And I wish I had a cute little pen that I could put here. But this is going to be my catch-all everything, catch-all everything here. Um, And then I did show you guys my um, horizontal, my skinny. We went through this in, on another video, and I will put it up here. Up here or up here. I'm not sure what side it'll be on. And then I want to show y'all what I've been using for the year, which I, I've been working out. Um, y'all, I've been doing so good. I purchased this one at the beginning of the year. I didn't put my name in it, but I have been using it and kind of decorating it a little bit. And I've been writing out like everything that I've been doing here as far as my meal prep and everything. I've been... I've been doing it in some weeks. Like I said, I'm not perfect, but yeah, I've been doing some of them. It's, I see I didn't decorate here, but I, I kind of fell off of using this one. I was in it. I got into an accident. Um, a lady hit me back in April and I kind of took the whole month of April off. So I didn't get back into um keeping up with my my journey here. But I plan on getting back into that. So that is one thing for my health and fitness that I will be getting back into. I also have my um, 
my Miss Maker Planner. I think I've used this a couple of times, y'all. This is one that I really forgot I've had. And I may just save this for um for next year or something. Because I haven't did too much in it. I did a little bit of writing in it. You know, when I was doing some of my custom cake orders. But this one here. This is my Faith Planner. This is my Faith Planner. I bought this last year, last July. And I love this color. It's like a frosted frosted color cover um with the champagne disc on it and i'm gonna show y'all how i've been using this so i don't know if you all heard of the U version app but i do use the U version app let me go back to june and i just every day you version come out with the a scripture and i just write those scripture in on each day's right and then for um for my daily, I'm just going to show y'all this. For my daily, I'm doing, um, I think it's called, it's on you version. It's a plan. And I want to say complete the Bible within a year or read the Bible in one year or something like that. And this is the plan. Like it gives you the verses to read and your chapters. And I just write them up here. I, every month, I um, beginning of the month, I go ahead and write them. That way I don't have to keep writing them every morning. Um, and here I just put what I'm grateful for that morning. And down here I put down, this is observation, but I put down, um, a verse that stood out to me, something that stood out to me. I'll write them, write them here. And then, um, down here where it says application, I just write my prayer for the day, my prayer for the day. And I know I would decorate it. Let me see if I have some in here. Yeah, see? It's, it's not decorating. I just put my washi. My washi in and now I write my little prayer and everything. Like, I, I'm grateful for abundance. I'm grateful for my life. It's just whatever comes to mind when I'm doing it. I just write it down. And that helps me stay on track with my um my faith and keep reading my Bible. I, now, I didn't do that in July. For July, I think I just used, um, I want to say it was probably the prayer for, Prayerful Planner. Uh, let me make sure. I think I did it for this entire first part of the year. I did Prayerful Planner. I think I did, y'all. I thought I had one printed out. Because I signed up for their email and uh, that's going to drive me crazy because I know I have it. Hold on. Let me look through here so I can show y'all. Okay. Here it is, y'all. I've been flipping over and skipping over it. Okay. All right. <laughs> so here is the, um, you can find it on www.prayerfulplanner.com. Um, and I think I just signed up for their email I was going to purchase, I don't know, I don't think I ever purchased one of their planners, but I think I was looking into it like a couple of years ago, but um, they send you to scripture every month, and I think they sent stickers as well, but if you're interested in that, you can go over there um, and sign up for their email, and they'll give you, um, like it says, day one, Timothy 4 and 16. And it says here, examine my ways, oh Lord. So it this is a good, um, good for journaling, your journaling prayer prompts. Um, but I did that for for the entire year of 2023, from July to the end of 2023, and then for January, I just switched over and did the entire Bible for the year. So I will be continuing to do this. I kind of fell off on some, and I have to go back and reread those chapters. Um to catch up for that month and let me see i think that is all so i have all of these this one uh this one oh this is a lot this is a lot. And when I'm on my planner stuff, y'all, I work in all of these. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have eight. 
but one is going to be totally just for work. So, and I say that it'll, I'll just say it'll be six because I'm not going to be using this one all the time. I'm just going to use this one to pull out pages. So I say I may just use it for like a, a catch all. But this is going to be my catch all. I mean, this is going to be my catch all and this is going to what I'm going to be referring to every day. Like when I get up, this one will stay on my desk. And this is what I will look at. This one I'll carry with me every day. So, yeah, this is how it's going to go. Um, I hope I didn't confuse y'all. But, yeah, that is my planner lineup for mid-year for 2024. I hope you guys have enjoyed that. <laughs> and I hope that y'all stay tuned with me while I do some of these spreads. I still consider myself a beginner because I don't have, like, <laughs> the experience like some of them have. I don't hear that I won't, but I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep on going <laughs> until I can get this and perfect it, y'all. And I think I, I want to I wanna get to the point where all these companies are sending me, like, stickers and sending their planners so I can do a review. I, that's the point I actually want to get at, y'all. That's where I really want to be um, in life and doing this. I just want to be one of those people there's a squad. There's be on their squads. That's what you call them. They'll be on their squads. They can do the reviews before the books are even released. Or the sticker books. instead of. But I know that's going to take some time. But that is still one of my goals. Um, to have completed by the end of the year. So I'm just going to be on here working. Trying to figure it out. And trying to do these spreads. And you know getting ideas from other people. Um just watching on youtube y'all i love doing it i can sit up and do that all day just watching everybody sometimes i will watch and you know do my sprays at the same time but yeah but anyway i'm not gonna talk y'all head off i'm not gonna keep on holding y'all but this is my lineup and um i'm gonna pick out which one of these i'm gonna come back with and do a spread with you guys um and just trying to kind of chit chat but you guys know I really appreciate you for um I really appreciate each and every one of you for sitting here and checking out my planner lineup. I really appreciate it. I really, really do appreciate it. But I want to show y'all this again, y'all, because I really truly love her. Let me get a shot of her by herself because she is so gorgeous to me. She is so gorgeous to me. And I think I don't know. And the reason why I say I say I don't know is because I know I didn't do enough sheets in here that to, to get me through a year. It might get me through the rest of this year, but I'm gonna find something to use her for. Cause she's just not gonna be sitting up here looking just just all pretty and I don't use her. Um I will be adding I don't know if I'll be adding this to my Etsy store. I don't know. If y'all think I should, drop in the comment below what y'all think if I should add her to my story. If, if y'all see it and y'all want it, I don't mind. But I did make this just personally for me. And look at my... I did me a newspaper article with me on here. <laughs> and it just says, you got this. Keep believing in yourself. Embrace your journey. Trust your abilities. Yeah. yeah. I be doing the most. But yeah, this is it for my 2024 20, mid-year planner line up um but i'm gonna go i'm gonna go i'm gonna go i promise i'm gonna go um but i really appreciate each and every one of you that has sat here through this video and watch me chat watch me chat listen to me chatting and um everything i'm so excited to be back on this planner journey even uh with happy planner um i know next year i will be adding kill of a plan i think i want to try one of her uh, planner and her sticker line i want to do that and i seen um i need to get into mojo jojo as well so i will be trying all of those and it's another one that i've seen i can't remember off the top of my head that i have um in store for the upcoming year for um 2025 but i will be expanding um my planner lines and doing trying different planners and seeing how they work out for me 
but that's it and that is all y'all i hope you guys have an amazing day an amazing week but until next time be blessed queens bye